Hey everyone, just a quick safety video for all of you who are using our TS4 MLPE products. We're getting some calls about once a week now uh, from people who are really mad that after they connect these TS4s together, they go to connect the home runs and there's live voltage. Like, nobody's been hurt yet, I don't think. <laughs> but I think it's time to like have a serious video about this, okay? So the, the issue is coming from our TS4 O and S product, right? So the O is the yellow one, it's our optimizer. The S does everything this does except optimize. Okay, I'm not gonna get into product descriptions. But what's happening is they're connecting these together in strings, and then when they go to uh, either make the, the pigtail or the uh, connection here to run to the inverter, they're seeing live voltage. And they're calling us, hey, what the hell's going on? What my guy just got bit? And so let's talk about that. Now, this is documented in the quick start guide that comes with every TS4, but I know y'all don't read, so that's why I'm making this video, okay? So, if you are using the O and S, these ship in the on state, meaning that as soon as you connect it to the module, which is the first thing you should do after mounting it to the module, you will get VOC from these leads. And as you connect 8, 10, 12 more of these things, well, the voltage just goes up. Now, the confusion comes two places. Okay, Either the installers are coming to us and they are familiar with another module level component, right? one of our competitors, which apparently ship in the off state. Now, our... TS4F, the, the orange sticker, or the 2F, which also orange, but it has two orange dots on it. This also ships in the off state. Okay, matter of fact, when you connect this to the module and take a VOC reading, you'll get 0 0.6 volts. That's what we call safety voltage. The only thing the TS4Fs do is rapid shutdown. So it is the most popular TS4 sold here in the United States. So people flock to these. We've installed hundreds of thousands of these with no issues. But when somebody transfers from the F to our monitored products and they're not familiar with them and they don't read the instructions, they think it acts like this. That's a fair assumption, I guess. However, just basic common electrical safety practices like always dictates or at least I I always do you treat everything like it's live like I just don't understand why you wouldn't use a meter or something before you start connecting things together like I get why but i don't understand it that's contrary to everything i've ever learned either from my navy submariner days and into this industry and like i said every week one of our techs gets crapped on by somebody because they didn't read the quick start guide they didn't follow standard electrical safety practices and it's funny Oh, sorry about the geese. They're yelling at each other this morning. <laughs> but they say things like, well, why don't you just put a sticker on this? And I go, okay, well, we have these things on here. These little yellow tabs that tell you the order to install our TS4s. Okay? It says, and I quote, connect short cables before long cables. 
The short cables go to the modules. The long cables go to the TS4s and the string. It's a self-correcting problem if you didn't know which one of those are, okay? Guess what installers do to this yellow tag right here? They throw it in the corner, they rip it off, throw it in the corner with the quick start guides. Okay, so I don't really think any amount of sticker or anything on here would help. Matter of fact, on the back of this, it says face this side toward the solar panel. Okay, panel instead of module. I'll let this slide for you know, one time. <laughs> but on the back here, it has a, an inscription with two arrows pointing to the shorter leads that says connect these first. So people weren't reading this. So we put this on there and they're still not reading it. They're still not connecting these things in the right order. So to sum it up, if you are using the TS4 O and S, or if you just want to go with colors, if you're using the yellow or the red TS4, those are live as soon as you plug them into the module. That's it. So if you have any other questions, or comments, or you want to watch me make a video on something else that's kind of gnawing on you, let me know. I'll make whatever you want. I'll do whatever you want. Well, almost. <laughs> but anyway, that's all I got. Thanks for watching. See ya.